Hey everyone, it's Nelson Miller here with PA Creative. Today I have another tutorial related to the Divi toggle and accordion modules. And in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to move the icon to the left. So by default, in both modules, the icon is always on the right side, and that's the only option, there's no settings. But I'm gonna show you how quick and easy it is to move it to the other side. As normal, if you're watching on YouTube, make sure you click the link in the description. This is where you'll get the CSS code for this little trick here. So you can see we're moving the icon and it's really just a nice way to get um, undo, you know, because every to toggle and accordion module, you know, on any Divi website is going to be on the right side. So this is like one of those things to undo, like it will look less Divi. All right. so. We're gonna do it in both modules and we're gonna do it you know, simultaneously. So let's just go ahead. First thing we're gonna do is add a CSS class. And I named them, you know, the custom class is pretty simple, like PA toggle icon left, PA accordion icon left, okay? We're just gonna do them, we're gonna, whichever one that you want, I'm gonna do them both, but whichever one that you want, you can copy it, all right? I'm gonna go into my website here, I have it all set up, so I have this is how it looks normally, obviously, both modules. So in this module here, I'm going to add the CSS class. So let's go ahead and put it in the advanced tab, CSS ID and classes, CSS class right there. All right, so that is for the toggle icon. Um, and then it'd be the exact same thing, like I said, if you're doing this for the accordion. Um, and make sure that you check out my other tutorials in this series. I have a whole bunch. Um, some are not released when you're watching this the first time, but anyway, uh, PA accordion icon left, okay? I, yeah, did that right. So the accordion, here it's on the right. Anyway, I have one that did, the previous tutorial was on adding an icon when this is open. You can actually see it in place right now. Um, so yeah, that's something that is also on Divi because Divi didn't have that by default. All right, so we're just adding this snippet. This is a really simple tutorial. Adding the class, adding the snippet, we're done. All right, so you can see here I have them labeled very clearly. Toggle module, accordion module. All right, so let's go ahead. Um, you could put this in your child theme or in your Divi theme options. I have links here about that. All right, so we're just gonna go ahead and copy the snippets. Here's the one for the toggle module. Uh, for me, I'm gonna put it right in my page settings because I am showing you live, right? All right, where are we at here? Up here, oh, you can see it moved over. I was, I was scrolled down too far. Now we'll do the accordion one and you wanna see it live, you can do that. There, you could see it, you could literally see it move. Um, so just to, to show that if I was to just do a little trick, like modify that, see that? Moves the title and the content over as well. Now you could uh, just do it where, um, trying to get here. So like right here in this snippet, we have two lines, the toggle title and the toggle content. Let's say you only wanted, um, I need that to be open. Let's say you only wanted it to be um, the top. Wait a minute, that should be moved over. You know what, it's because I'm in the builder. Let's say I take that out, the toggle content. Now I'm gonna exit the builder and show you. CSS doesn't always work in the builder. All right, so here you can see the toggle always has the content and title aligned to the left, right? Um, but since we're moving the icon over, we're adding that space just to the title now. And again, by default, it's gonna move this over as well, right? But um, since I just took it out, it's, it's keeping this over. So that's your choice, whether this is aligned or whether the title and text are aligned. That's totally up to you. Um, down here, in fact, there you can see, um, the opposite. In fact, the spacing isn't quite the same. I might have to adjust that, but you could do that too. So you could separate the snippet, like right here, right? Instead of having 
all these both lines in one, you could say, well, maybe the title is one, maybe the title is one of these of a specific distance, right? And then you can do another snippet where the content is a specific distance. Um, but yeah, for our example, we actually took that out and we're just saying move the title over, right? So it's up to you. Um, yeah, that pretty much is it. I have that explanation right here. If you like these tutorials, then you can subscribe because we release tutorials every single week. We have some freebies coming up. We also release plugins and um, child themes, products, courses, that kind of thing for Divi. So that's what you'll get here. And that's all I have for today. I hope you enjoy that. And we'll see you all in the next video.